Young master, I've been waiting for you. I thought you might do this, so I've prepared a gate to the old school. That's fast. Were you spying on us? <laughs> Rumor has it that the forbidden building is very dangerous. I've made a direct connection to the dragon's nest. Hmm, just as I expected, Jeffrey. So unnaturally efficient, as always. Come, fake hero. Wait a minute. We can't just go jumping into the dragon's lair. You always have to grind a few levels first. Fool! I don't even know the meaning of the word level grinding. I must eat the dragon egg and open my heart as soon as I can. I have no time to waste on repetitive battles. Uh, first of all, I don't really believe any of this egg-eating business. But if they can walk around inside their hearts, I guess it could work for demons, somehow. Wait up, Mal! Ah, it's you again. So you're really going, huh? For honor students like you, the Forbidden Land is like a convenient graveyard. If your words could scare me, I wouldn't be reckless enough to attempt opening my heart to begin with! I am fully prepared for my journey, and I won't let you stand in my way! Doesn't seem like he wants to open his heart, so why is he so determined to do this? It's impossible. There's not even the slightest ray of hope. I guess he really hates my title. Though, that is what he said, so maybe I should pay more attention. You really do look prepared, Mal. I won't try to stop you. But in return, we're coming with you. What? Why? This has nothing to do with you! Go to class like you always do. Lucky for us, it's the weekend. Yes, we've finished our homework and have already read up for next class. This is quite a predicament, Miss Rasbarrel. I would prefer that you not interfere with the young master. Oh, Mr. Jeffrey, you've got the wrong idea. I don't want to join him. I just want to see for myself whether or not the legend is true. And I want to see if the great honor student Mal can actually pull off this outrageous stunt. However... Don't worry, I'll take care of Mal for you. This is quite disturbing. Even I didn't expect this to happen. It's all right, Jeffrey. They're just afraid of me. If an honor student like me can open my heart, the number one delinquent won't have much to brag about anymore. Relax. I believe in me. If you insist, young master, I pray for the worst of luck. Mr. Jeffrey really does care for you a lot, huh, Lord Mal? You just realized that now? Of course! He's my hand-picked personal butler. He's the best in the business. The old schoolhouse, a.k.a. the Forbidden Building, is the oldest building that remains of the Academy, which continuously rebuilds and expands. It is located in the deepest center, but its gates have been closed tight, and one can only see its interior by traveling across dimension gates. But, since its closure, the situation inside still remains a mystery, since no one who enters has ever returned. The interior of this ancient building is full of danger. Unbeknownst from its abandoned appearance, it remains unexplored, where even daredevils hesitate to enter. This building's getting pretty old. I've gotten rid of the dragons, so I'd better get on with the rebuilding. Huh? I sense others nearby. Great, I'm uber shy. I heard lots of rumors about this place. A famous one is about a legendary honor student who ate a dragon egg and turned into a legendary delinquent. Aren't you curious being an honor student and all? Fine, let's hear it. But only if it tells whether he ate it with salt and pepper or hot sauce. You really hung up on that, huh? It's my greatest concern at this point. One of my goals is to make hot sauce the official condiment for eggs. You still hate salt and pepper? Disliking things is key to being an honor student. Who wants to eat all their vegetables? We eat everything on the plate. Food group be damned! No honor student can claim that. Our Lady eats all the school lunches for our absent classmates. And since everyone is always absent, that's like 30 lunches a day. How is that even possible? 
Once I take home Ek, I'm gonna make you a feast that you'll eat to the very last bite. <laughs> More of your useless meddling. Huh? So you've never gone to a home economics class, Miss Barrow? But I thought you had perfect attendance. I do, but home Ek's a special case at this school. No one knows where the kitchen room is, and none of the teachers have ever seen the home Ek teacher. None of the fearless badasses who went looking for the cooking class have ever been seen again. The school is full of stories about never being seen again. There it is! That's the dragon egg, right? That was pretty easy. We didn't even see the shadow from this legendary dragon. Shouldn't there be more action and adventure than this? Fool, stop daydreaming! Reality is never that romantic! Hey, stop right there! <laughs> Who dares tell me what to do? Cooking is love! Cooking is power! See you here! Cooking is sanity. Ah, more weirdos. I wonder if they're comedians. Order! We are chefs! Under order from a master, we will take the dragon egg! <laughs> you plan to steal from an honor student? <laughs> I'll slice you up and serve you smoked with my dragon egg breakfast! <laughs> 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 